Welcome my Libras. <laughs> How are y'all? I hope y'all doing good. I'm doing great. <laughs> so let's see. Let me clear this energy from my last read because yeah, it got a little while. So we definitely need to clear that. <laughs> thank you guys. I want to thank you guys so much for everyone who ordered from the website. We are completely sold out, guys. We are actually having to shut the shop down so we can restock. Okay, so oh excuse me. Thank you all for the support and the love. It's greatly appreciated. Y'all just don't know. Y'all keep me motivated. Y'all keep me going. Um, thank you all so much. So, so much. Greatly appreciated. No doubt. No doubt. Like, you guys have been my rock, my support system. I, I mean, you guys keep me wanting to post, okay? And y'all are helping me reach my goals and my dreams. And it's greatly appreciated. Like, I love you guys. I really do. I miss you guys when I'm away for too long. <laughs> Y'all email me and say, hey, what's up? What's going on? Where you at? Where you been? And, you know, help me stay focused. Help me stay on track. And I dig that. <laughs> all right, this guys, I've been bundling up Sage all day. <laughs> it's going to be back on the website, guys. All right. So be on the lookout for that very, very soon. Okay, well, this jumped out. Let's see. Mm -mm. Libra is November 1st through the 7th. November 1st through the 7th. What message do you have for Libras? What message is there for Libras? I'm going to shuffle three more times and then we're going to jump in. One, two, <laughs> three. Let's go. Let's do it. All right. At the bottom, we have the Six of Wands. Okay. And then we got the seven of pentacles. So are you waiting for your moment to shine? Or you've been waiting and you're ready to shine? <laughs> Let's see what we got. All right. So I got the three of swords. The death card. Eight of swords. Five of pentacles. High priestess, two of pentacles. Seven of wands. See, yeah, that came out when I was shuffling earlier. So you do feel this way. Okay. Okay. There it is again. Okay, so the same cards did jump out. So they were meant to come out in the beginning, which was the Seven of Pentacles. No, it was the Four of Swords. I'm sorry, it's the Four of Swords and the Seven of Wands. Some of y'all, okay, I'm going to put this out there. And I'm just saying, this is what I see, okay? Some of y'all are practicing magic. Or you've paid someone to do a spell on someone. Um, for sure, for sure. I got the magician and the moon. A lot of times when I do see this, this could be someone trying to manifest here. Okay, someone trying to manifest but I feel like someone was practicing magic under this full moon, possibly. But I'm definitely seeing that there's been some magic done. We got the devil and the ace of pentacles and the three of pentacles and the page of cups. Yeah, definitely like paying someone. Some of y'all pay someone to do some to do some uh, magic. 
and you're waiting for results. Seven of Pentacles is being patient, waiting for those results to, you know, come to you. Queen of Swords, there you guys go. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I'm not sure if you're trying to break someone up here with the Three of Swords energy. I'm not sure if you're trying to break someone up. You want so I feel like you want Two of Swords and the Temperance card is someone who feels uncomfortable. It's like you you're not comfortable with making a certain type of decision. I don't feel like you want to hurt anyone. Like you don't want to I don't feel like you want to hurt someone. Maybe you just want someone to um I don't feel like you want to physically harm this person, but maybe you want them to break up. Mine's a death card here. The star. Okay, this is Aquarius' energy. Um, Knight of Wands. See, yeah, the Moon and the Ten of Swords. There's some type of betrayal here. Yeah, you don't want somebody to go back. Because I got the Four of Cups and the Knight of Wands. Okay, you want someone to lose hope and don't go back. Okay, the Four of Cups and the Knight of Wands. Yeah. Yeah, the King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Someone here could be married. Okay. Someone here could be married. Someone's giving someone what they want, which is the love. Okay, but I'm getting like, yeah, see the four of pentacles. You want this person to stay connected and close to you and give you what you want. But I'm I'm seeing here that someone could be married or live. There's a live-in arrangement with someone. You're waiting to see what this person is going to say. There's possibly third-party energy, okay, definitely, with the Three of Cups and the Queen of Wands. I got the Hierophant and Temperance, Sagittarius and Taurus. Okay, lots of info. Okay, why is the Eight of Swords here? Some of y'all are trying to bind someone to you. The Eight of Swords is definitely like binding The Three of Wands. We got the Queen of Cups. The Empress. Okay. Someone's mother could be involved here. Or I'm getting someone who's very... Um, you could want this person to be more kinder to you. Sweet towards you. But the Empress card is you guys' energy as well. Lots of three of wands here. The Hierophant. You're waiting for someone to tell somebody something. Queen of Pentacles, the Sun, and the Three of Cups.
Yeah, see, I'm getting like gluing you two together. Four of Pentacles and the Two of Cups. <clears throat> The two of swords, like, you don't want to be separated. Okay. Why is the emperor here? The will of fortune and the devil. Okay, I'm getting giving someone a chance. There's that moon and that ten of swords again and that three of cups. Why is the uh, five of pentacles here? Okay, I'm here and stop talking so much. Making it look obvious. Okay. Oh. You were trying to find out something here in the past. Okay. Someone's trying to hide something. Okay, so you, you, there's something that you wasn't sure about. You didn't have any knowledge of. You felt like someone was trying to hide something from you. Trying to hide their plan. Okay, so moving forward, it looks like like you're standing back now and watching the drama unfold. Yeah, like <laughs> okay, so maybe you want someone to regret lying to you. Okay. So this is why the Six of Wands is here because you're looking to come out on in on top, okay? You feel like this person should have told you something, but they lied about it. And you want to make them regret it, okay? Five of Cups and the Nine of Swords, okay? Yeah, it's like now you are, okay, we got the Queen of Cups and the Judgment. I'm getting that there's a lot of confusion. Ooh, yeah, lots of confusion. There's like jealousy here. There's envy here. There's competition here. And I'm just getting like you just sitting back watching the Page of Cups and the Page of Swords. Like you just watching it all unfold. Um, your energy is the Seven of Wands.
Like I said, you you sitting back watching this. <laughs> you're sitting back watching everything unfold. You're trying to make this person have regrets. Okay, because someone here lied. Someone here lied here. Somebody lied. Being sneaky. Someone's stealing all of the attention. I'm seeing that as well, too. Now, how this other person is viewing the situation, they feel as if they are single. Okay, they're single male, single female, and they move how they want to move. They're having fun. They are enjoying themselves. They're enjoying life. Um, they're not going to stop. Okay, the Ten of Swords and the Hangman, they, they don't plan on uh, stopping, with their, stopping their life to uh, appease anyone or anything. Okay, so they're living their life. Okay. I feel like you, in your hopes and fears, you got the Ace of Cups and the Two of Cups. I feel like some of you want a relationship. We got the Strength card here. It could be a Leo. I feel like in you're hoping to have a relationship or partnership with this person. But this person looks at their, themselves or the situation as they're single. Mine's the Ace of Swords here. Okay, so maybe you found out the truth about a situation. I got the Queen of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles here. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, male and female energy here. Justice. Okay. Justice is uh, Libra's energy. Someone is telling someone that they love them. The Eight of Wands and the Lovers, um, the Ten of Swords and the Ten of Cups, but there's no relationship, okay? I'm getting that a relationship ended. Somebody here is just having fun. They're just having fun, but someone is working on a business or working on a marriage or a relationship. You're waiting for the truth to be revealed. You're ready for some type of truth to come out. Some of you may be wondering, like, if someone put some type of spell or something on someone. Or you guys are, um, you guys are doing it. Yeah, because I'm getting someone here, um... Uh, is moving on or has moved on or left. I'm getting, but someone left but found their way back. Okay, the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. This is looks like a marriage, okay? You may have thought there wasn't any hope left, but someone... Here is going back and forth, and you don't care for it either. You don't really like it. You don't like it. Um, you don't have all the details. And I feel like you're a little confused. Because it's just a lot of people. It's a lot going on. Yeah, somebody here, you may have thought like, oh, I thought, you know, somebody here is just out having a bunch of fun. Like, really? Somebody really is out here just living their best life. For real, for real. Somebody's out here living their best life, and they're, they feel single and free, like they can do that. But I'm not sure if you guys are trying to put a wedge in between that or what. Or like, are y'all getting 
certain type of workings done to kind of like bind somebody to you. But I feel like it, somebody is binded. I'm getting like a binded love here. But the thing of it is, is are you trying to bind someone who, um, you know, free will, this person is, feels like they're single. So they're doing single things. They're living a single life. Okay. They're out here having fun doing with what they want to do. Okay, everyone does have free will. We have to keep that in mind as well, too. All right, so y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. And I'm going to chat with you guys later. Ciao for now.